What's up guys and welcome back to some more Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. As you guys know in the last video, we finished off the entire chapter and we got to see the end of Mommy Longlegs and our first look at the Chapter 3 monster. It was an insane video, but we're going back in today because just like in Chapter 1, if you guys haven't seen these, this series already, we're going to be hacking all of Chapter 2. We're going to be flying around, finding, and finding everything that we possibly can. And if you guys, like I said, if you guys have seen Chapter 1, you guys know some of the stuff that we could potentially find outside the map. Now, I don't think there'll be as much stuff because in Chapter 1, that was like the first version of the game and i think they i don't know i will we'll, we'll have to find out what's outside the map but i'm hopeful and uh, i think we'll be finding some new rooms some new offices and maybe if we're lucky even a closer look at that chapter three monster because as you guys know we saw his hand so i really want to fly outside that gate and see if we can get a full look at him and uh, it's going to be fun. But of course, if you guys are new to the channel and you're looking for more Poppy Playtime content, this is your place to be. Everyone in the comment section down below will tell you this is your place to be. Hit that subscribe button right now if you're looking for all the latest Poppy Playtime news, videos, secrets, and stuff like that. And for more hacking videos, because there's going to be quite a few more. Anyways, let's go ahead and hop in and begin. Now, we're going to start somewhere interesting. Now, we should probably start at the beginning of the chapter, but I figure since we're already at the end of the game, if I press load game, it should put us there. Why don't we go ahead and start there and, you know, we'll kind of do it in reverse and go backwards. So, let's go ahead and load up a checkpoint and hop back into the game. Now, keep in mind, this is a longer chapter than chapter one. There's a lot more places to hack and fly through, so we're going to have our hands full here. So, it looks like we're starting right here and if you guys don't know where we are well we go and open up the gate and this is the end of the game all right now the main area i want to go to is the ending where that giant claw is okay because we want to get there and see what's behind that gate but let's go ahead and start by opening up our little hack menu right here and let's start flying around okay so we got to go to up here toggle debug camera one and we are now in fly mode now let's have a look and see if we actually have a character model no we do not if you guys have seen their new toys that they just released i think with u2s um there's like a new toy called the player and it shows like a yellow you know guy but yeah it looks like we're not actually that guy now let's actually make things a little bit brighter here and increase the gamma to four which oh my gosh look how bright that is and let's go ahead and head outside the map and have a look around and see if we can potentially find anything okay it is pitch black out here you can't see a thing. There's a little bit of lighting out there, but this is kind of what I expect to see on most of the chapter. Not really much of anything. The main areas that we want to see, though, is like the Kissy Missy section and some other stuff and see where she walks away to and stuff like that. All right, so let's go ahead and do Gamma and let's try Gamma 6. So now it's way brighter. If there was anything out here, we would be able to see it. And it looks like there is nothing going on outside so as soon as you get done getting chased by mommy long legs she just kind of disappears now obviously the chase sequence takes place up here and uh yeah there is nothing here let's go ahead and get like an above ground look here and just make sure we're not missing anything so look this is the sewer system right here which that's another area that we definitely have to hack to at some point whenever she's chasing us and have a look around in there but yeah look around in here there is nothing in here now there's parts where her hand actually reaches out at you like right here and as you, as you guys can see there's actually nothing there but there is a tunnel for her to like go through which is very interesting to see oh look there she is wait a minute look you can see her right here you see her shadow right there it's way too dark and there's got to be a way to make it brighter i think let me see if i can find the command okay so this is interesting i actually went to turn on uh the view mode lit which is like how you like make everything super bright and look what it says it says debug view modes not allowed in test or shipping builds so i wonder if they set something in the settings to not be able to see this but uh yeah she's there she's just it's just like the huggy wuggy chase scene in chapter one where you can like see him just outside of view now here's the main area where we actually build the part and then we get chased by her it's really dark over here so if anything we'll return to that later on but for right now let's go ahead and go back to the main player and let's continue on with the normal game here so it's going to be brighter obviously as you guys can see but uh let's go ahead and go back this way now i don't think we see her at this oh yeah doesn't she she comes from behind us so wait when does she actually show up Hold on, I wanna... Uh, she's gonna chase us though no matter what, right? I, I would need to like somehow pause the game, which I think there is a way to do that. But I think I have to put my hand on here first and then that like activates her. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna throw our hand at it and then immediately fly towards her, okay? So throw hand and then go here, fly over here. We should be able to see her while that's opening. Yep, there she is. Oh my God, that is so scary seeing her chase after you. Okay, wait, I should probably go back. Oh my God, go back, go back, go back. Wait, the door, what's happening? Oh. That's close. Okay, wait, wait, uh, no, 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 close. Oh my God, she's in. What the, I was too late to close the door. Oh my God, look how this looks when the brightness is way too high up. Okay, guys, we're back. And uh, I just need to get under here, please. No, I missed the handle. Oh my God, no, don't get in, what? Oh my God, okay, okay, okay. So it's if you stand right there that she eats you. Got it. All right, well, 
Goodbye, mommy long legs. Okay, so let's go ahead and toggle debug camera. And uh, yep, that, this is her getting eaten in there. This is a different angle of it. Oh my gosh, dude, this scene is so brutal. Look at her. Okay, now wait, is there anyone outside the wall? Look, currently there's nobody. Wait, there it is. Look, the hand. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, Gamma six, look, the creature is here. Okay, the hand. Oh, they knew, they knew. Yep, they knew. Okay, so you can't actually see who's on the other side of the wall. Yep, it's just, look at that. There's no one there, it's just a floating hand. But it is some kind of like animatronic. Like you can definitely tell, look, it puts it right here. It's, it's definitely some kind of animatronic. Now, here's the question, right? Is this daddy long legs? Is this the son? Because if you guys don't know, there was a poster in the game early on, which I pointed out in my playthrough, of the family. It was mommy long legs, daddy long legs, and then like a son or something. So I'm curious if this might be daddy long legs. Maybe he had his outfit stripped from him, and now he's just like an animatronic endoskeleton or something like that. Or maybe it's some kind of weird Coraline creature? If you guys have ever seen Coraline, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But that hand is very, very, very reminiscent of Coraline. So I'm wondering if that's, you know, something along the lines of like a spider or something like that. Now let's go ahead and have a look around just outside to make sure we don't miss anything out here. So that's where it comes from right there. And yeah, like I said, you can't see a thing. It's really unfortunate that you can't view mode um, lit or actually unlit or you can't really view anything see like it just doesn't work I don't know if maybe I'm just running it wrong or something like that but yeah I mean either way you can clearly tell there's nothing there all right so let's go ahead and fly over here let's have another look at the other side of the map we definitely got to hack the ending too to see if we can find anything out there but yeah, everything here looks pretty normal looks like this is where we head up okay let's go ahead and go back to normal mode and uh, continue on with the game now obviously like I said we are gonna have our brightness pretty high here so uh, keep that in mind. Okay, let's go ahead and go up this way. We gotta head all the way up to the top and then head towards the train station, which we should be able to see Poppy on the way there too. She should be up on that little balcony, like looking at us, or at, you know, at the end se se uh, section. Um, what the heck is? Do I jump over there? Okay, there we go. I don't know why I thought there'd be like a, a swing thing there. Okay, that door. Wait, that door is locked. Let's see if we can fly through here. I don't think there'll be anything here. Yeah, there's nothing here. I mean, obviously, look, it, it's like a room, but it, it just leads to nothing. So, yeah, it's kind of what you expect, you know? They saw the hacking videos, I'm sure they did, you know, from everyone. Oh, look, a, wait, a tape. Wait, we actually didn't watch this. Oh, wait, we gotta watch this. I forgot all about this. We picked it up, but we never watched it. What is... Log code wait a minute. 08502. In relation, experiment 1006. Oh, this is the new creature. The prototype. What? A close call occurred this week in which he nearly breached containment. Oh... The prototype seemingly disassembled the digital alarm clock within his room and utilized the battery, along with several other components, to create a laser pointer, which he then fired into the security camera, disabling it. What? These actions allowed him 28.3 seconds completely unmonitored. Once function returned to the camera, the what room appeared to be empty. One surveillance specialist went in to confirm oh, no. his absence. It's like Jurassic World. However, Upon opening the door, she realized that the prototype had hidden in one of the camera's blind spots. Oh. The prototype attempted to escape through the open door. However, another surveillance specialist was able to remotely relock the door, despite the other specialist still being inside. Oh no, what did it do? One casualty occurred. The prototype seems to possess an unprecedented level of intelligence beyond that of all other test subjects, as well as an alarming willingness to commit violence. Further mm. suppression treatments will need to be enacted to ensure that no other experiments develop these qualities. Experiment 1170, Huggy Wuggy, remains the optimal outcome due to his sufficient intelligence paired with maximum obedience. End of log. Oh. So that thing is just like a killing machine. Like, literally, it's a machine. I don't know. Mm, that's interesting. I how did we not watch this on the ending like ending of our playthrough? I just skipped right by this, but that's our like first look basically at the chapter three monster or whatever that thing is. This could be the thing behind it all, you know? Like this could be the main villain that like we, we don't know anything about just yet, but it's like there in the background, it's watching us, it's aware that we're here. That is actually crazy and very cool to hear. I, I don't know how we missed that. So that's like, oh man, that thing's crazy. And that poor scientist or whatever that was like stuck in there with it, you know they're dead. Like they are definitely dead. That hand got them good. I mean, obviously, I don't think it's just a hand, right? It's obviously connected to something. Even though all we've seen is a hand and an arm, there's gotta be a body to this thing, but I'm just curious as to what. Okay, so here's 
Poppy. Let's go ahead and rescue her. Okay, so let's go fly mode while this is happening. And wait, Did why is she just... Oh, yeah. There's an up-close look at Poppy. Oh, my God. Look inside her eye. Oh, that's oh, creepy. Oh, my God. <laughs> What's inside her head, Poppy? Oh, my God. <laughs> look at that. The inside of her face. Wait, where would she go? Oh, wait. Does she actually... Oh, okay. So she just stops walking right here. Yeah. And oh, oh my God. <laughs> look at that face. That is so creepy looking. Ugh. She's like staring right at our soul or something. That is just creepy. So there's a up close look at Poppy if you guys ever want to see that. All right, let's have a look out here. So this area I thought would be utilized more because look at all the spider webs and stuff like that. I think that creature is a spider. I don't think these were left by Mommy Longlegs. I feel like whatever that thing is with the big hand is some kind of spider or something along those lines. And that's what left these here. But if we go over here, okay, so you can you can see there's a path for the train this way. Now, the path that we take is over there. So let's see if this leads anywhere. I don't think it will. But like I said, we got to test everything here, okay? Because you never know. Like I said, they definitely saw the hacking videos. So I don't think we're going to find anything crazy. Or if we do, it's going to be out here on purpose by the devs, you know? But I don't think, yeah, there's nothing out here. Okay, let's go ahead and fly back. And let's see if we can actually go to the part underneath here. So if you guys know, you know, if you guys have seen the chapter gameplay, you know that these lead to different areas. And nope, they are completely cut off. Yeah, they're not loaded in at all. It's interesting that this section over here is still here, though. Because I would have thought this would have went away. Isn't this? Yeah, this is where we just were. I would have thought that would have, like, went away and saved on some performance. But, all right, so the only thing we can really do here is go on to the train and continue the game. Okay, so let's go ahead and make our way down there, hop inside the train, start it up, and go to that ending sequence and see if we can find anything new. All right, here we go. So, one, three, two, four. So, I got to do one, three, two, four, and it begins. Okay, so... This is going to be interesting, though, because as soon as we activate the flying, I don't think we'll be able to keep up with the train, but let's find out here. Okay, so, oh, that's what the train looks like from out here. I never actually looked at it before I got in it. All right, so let's go ahead and start going ahead. It's going to start moving very fast, and I'm curious if it goes to, like, a different level to where it's just, like, constantly, I don't know, like, going in the same location over and over again, because I don't think this is just a gigantic train track that goes on for as long as it actually seems like it does whenever you're in it, so... Let's go ahead and try to catch up in front of it here, because obviously it's going to come right this way. And let's see if we can spot anything here. Okay, so... Oh my gosh, this is very long. There's no way it's actually as long as it seems like. Oh man, this is a cool cinematic shot, though. This is cool. Okay, so... Oh, also, we might be able to find out... Look, look, look. Yeah, see, the train must teleport. Because look at it. It's like untextured right here. Oh no, it, no. It... Okay, so... Poppy's talking, but we're going to go this way. This is the way that should lead to... To victory like safety to see where it actually goes sorry. so I this is the way that we could have went if poppy didn't betray us right here and it leads like nowhere me. of course i mean kind of what you figure and then that's where you we're going now oh game. my goodness well, i can't believe she betrayed us i can't right. believe it dude we had so much time to think we had so reflect. much time time to figure out exactly okay so we go this way see. now Look, the other air, the map is still there. Wait, it's actually a full track. Look at this. It's a full track. Oh my god. Wait, I don't want to lose it. Oh crap. Okay, so this is where we start going down. Hold on, let me in. I want to go down here and see. Okay, so this is where it starts going down really fast. It's hard to like stay in here because you have to go backwards because I can't see. Yeah, if I go forwards, I can't see where I'm going. I mean, I guess we can see from up here though. So we just go straight down. So we're actually going further into the factory. Yeah, we are going, oh my, we're going way deeper in. Look at this. So that's that's where we were, which we were already far down. Now we're going even farther down. That is actually insane. Now I'm also curious if you don't stop the train, because there's a stop button, you know, that you have to pull. I'm wondering if you don't stop it. Like right now, I think it's going off. What if I just continue to go down? Does anything happen? Like there's no way this can just go on forever, right? But it seems like it is. Hold on, let's keep going. I'm gonna follow it. We are look at how far down we're going. Oh my gosh. So obviously things are only gonna get scarier the further and further down and into this place you go. But toggle. Okay, so here we are on the train. Yeah, I think it just makes it look, look, look. Yep, this is what it does. Look. It makes it seem like you're going somewhere, but you're actually not. Because if the train was moving right now, I would be getting like stuck behind it. But look, we're not actually going any further down oh my gosh that's how they did that so they left this the same but they had this like move on like a track so it looks like you're moving 
Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. So let's go ahead and stop the train now. And then let's quickly hop back out. So our character will fall over on the ground. Let's see. What stops us, though? Like, what flips... I guess just us doing it. Yeah, we just flip over naturally. Okay, so there's no actual, like, creature that does it. I thought maybe we'd see the hand or something like that, but no. And that's the end right here. Yeah, so this should be where it just cuts off right here. So, yeah, it is just a normal... Like, look, we start right there, and we don't go anywhere at all. It just seems like we do. That is so interesting. It's a cool way of doing that. Okay, so wait, what's happening now? Oh, look, play care. So that's where the sign just kind of pops out right there. Wait, what does that look like from the inside? Oh my god, it looks so much more natural than from the outside. Look, you go outside, it's just a floating sign. <laughs> it looks so much more unnatural. Oh my god, I like broke my... Yeah, I broke my camera. Oh my god, I can't... It broke. Okay, let's, let's get back in so we can stop breaking it. All right, so this will continue the chapter right here. So guys, I mean, we hacked the whole ending of the game. Now, like I said, there's a lot more places to hack in this chapter. Like, a lot more. We can hack a lot of the Mommy Long Legs parts. We can la hack the whole Kissy Missy part. Um, a lot of just the, the mini games that we played. Imagine that one where you have to play Wacka Huggy. Oh my gosh, that, or I think it's Wacka Wuggy. That one would be so much fun to go through. So if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know. Show this video a ton of support. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I think we broke our game here. Because, yeah, I'm just stuck in the train now. I don't I don't know how I'd get out. I'm pretty sure I broke it. So, yeah, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.